assalamu alaikum students i hope you all are fine welcome to the online class so let's start our third term and the first chapter is chapter number 9 and its name is industry and the name of this section is types of industries so now let's discuss in detail about the industry so the definition of the industry is industry refers to the production of items using raw materials Industries include steel mills and the manufacture of vehicles, pharmaceuticals and items of everyday use. Raw materials may be in the form of minerals or products from forest and agriculture. So these are transformed into more useful and valuable items. So in short, we can say that industry are basically that area in which we manufacture new things with the help of a raw materials and these raw materials are uh, obtained from forest and agriculture and from different sources and then we use in manufacturing of different products so now let's discuss about the types of industries so there are basically two types of industries process industries and the second one is manufacturing industries now let's discuss one by one so the first one is process industries in process industries raw materials are changed are and made suitable for use by manufacturing industries cotton gining is a process industry in which cotton fiber is separated from the seed so this one is an example of a process industry similarly the removal of impurities from copper ore is another example of a process industry so in simple words we can say that so process industries are those industries in which we make something new with the help of a raw material so the example of this industry is cotton gining and also the removal of impurities from copper ore so the second type is manufacturing industry Manf the industries that use processed materials to manufacture final product are called manufacturing industries so basically these are those industries in which we manufacture final product with the help of a with the help of a different raw materials for example cotton yarn is made from raw cotton and cotton cloth is made from cotton yarn similarly steel is produced using iron ore in a manufacturing industry so this one is an example of the manufacturing industry in which steel is produced by using iron ore so the next one is uh, about the factors that affect the location of industry so there are basically different factors that affect the location of industry so now let's discuss one by one the first one is availability of raw material the second is availability of electricity the third one is distance from the market fourth one is a transport cost fifth one is availability of labor sixth one is capital and the sixth seventh one is a garment so now let's discuss in detail so the first one is availability of raw material so in this paragraph we basically discuss about the availability of different raw materials for the manufacturing of final and different products so there are basically different raw materials that are uh, discussed here so uh, now let's discuss one by one sugarcane raw cotton iron and copper ores marble limestone clay are examples of a raw material so these are the basically raw materials that are used for the manufacturing of different products so here is example of sugarcane going to sugar mill Sugarcane is basically using a uh, used as a raw material for the manufacturing of sugar. Okay, so the next one is availability of electricity. So the basic purpose and the basic thing that we use for in industries is availability of electricity. This is very very important uh, thing that is used basically in the industries. an industry will set up in an area where there is an uninterrupted supply of electricity to ensure a smooth flow of production so uh, if we want to gain the good product then we uh, should focus on the availability of electricity because it's a very very essential factor the third one is a market demand 
so market demand is also a very 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 important factor a market is a place where manufactured goods are sold large cities have large market therefore large cities are considered appropriate places for establishing industries so if we manufacture something then we should supply in a good area for a good uh, for a good selling purpose so market demand is also a very important factor fourth one is a transport cost so if we manufacture something new then uh, it's very very important to transport that uh, product into different areas so for that purpose we need different transport so the transport that are basically used for the manufacture for the transporting of different things are basically these road transport railway and shipping are major means of transport so these are the major means of transport and these are very very important the fifth one is also very very important factor that is availability of labor human being operate machines therefore labor is an essential element of industrial activity so without labor we can't do anything and we can't prepare anything because all the machines are also work with the help of a labor so laborers are basically the main factors of industries the sixth one uh, is basically uh, are of two types uh, capital and the government capital is a large amount of money required to establish an industry capital is basically considered as a money so money is a very very important for industry for establishing the industry so this is also very important factor if we want uh, a good product then we uh, then we should invest a very large amount of capital on industry so the last one last basic purpose of uh, factor of the industry is the government the government has an important role in the development of industry governments frame uh, frame industrial policies and can offer incentives like relax the relaxation in custom duties low price electricity tax exemption government also establish industrial state and special areas where all infrastructure and facilities are available so we can say that government play a very very important role in establishment of any industry because government provide very good area in which all the facilities are available so now come towards the exercise the first question of the exercise is define the term processing industry and the answer is on page number 117 and the answer of the first short answer is in process industry raw materials are changed and made suitable for use by manufacturing and this answer ends at of a process industry this one is the answer of question number 1 now come towards the question number 2 that is list the main factors that affect industrial location and the answer is on page number 117 and the answer of the second question starts from this line manufacturers have to be considered before setting up an industry the most important being and the answer ends at garment now come towards the mcqs cotton gining is a dash industry and the answer is processing industry a dash is a place where manufactured goods are sold and the answer is a market industry refers to the dash of items using raw material and the answer is production cotton gining is a process industry in which cotton is separated from the seeds steel is produced using iron dash in a manufacturing industry and the answer is ore so i hope you understand the today's lecture take care and allah hafiz